Welcome back, guys, to the channel. Damn, it's been a while since I did a voiceover. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be talking a lot in this video, man. It's been a while. Got some stuff to say, but anyways, let's get right to it. You guys can see here, man, lineup with enhancement, you know what I'm saying? Let's show you something special, you know? At the end of the day, guys, your hairline is everything. You know that. Sometimes, you know what I'm saying, you reach a certain age, certain factors, you know what I'm saying, might not make you have the lineup that you really want. So then spice it up a little bit, you know? And at the end of the day, no one's trying to get clowned, right? So you gotta make sure it looks good. And I'm gonna show you guys how to do that, all right? Okay, first of all, you gotta brush, man. You gotta brush your hair. You know that by now if you watch the video. You gotta brush. Okay, don't even try to cut your hair if it's not brushed, you know what I'm saying? Then you're, obviously, you're just confused if you're doing that, okay? If you guys don't have a beard, you know what I'm saying? Just, just skip that part, you know what I'm saying? Hopefully, God will bless you and you'll be able to get a beard soon. All right, all right, let's see, just keep going, come on. All right. So, as you guys know, when it comes to your haircut, you gotta blend everything down, even with the lineup, especially if you have the front taper, which I advise if you follow this channel and you're versatile, you know, you have braids, curls, all that stuff. That front taper is very important, you know what I'm saying? It's crucial. But if you look here, some parts, if I'm honest, of my, of my lineup are a bit more thinned towards the corners, you know what I'm saying? So it's like, when you fade the front there, you know what I'm trying to say? You kind of blend everything together. Just see what's going on there? See? You just blend the darker parts, you know what I'm saying? Just fade that part down, you know, and try to just make it be leveled, okay? This is the reason why people with shorter hair tend to have better lineups. You know what I'm saying? It's not always, but Typically, you know, because you can make it look better with shorter hair. And um, parting the front and, and fading the front is another way of getting that while having hair. So it's a cheat code, you know what I'm saying? All right, all right, so as you see, I'm using the guard here, you guys know. The guard is closed with the one guard on it and um, just going downwards, just going downwards. Trying to clip as much as I can, making sure, of course, it looks even all the way throughout as much as I can get it. You know, and of course, brush. Like, listen, guys, you gotta keep brushing, okay? See, now, I'm going upwards now. Just because I wasn't really getting the desired effect that I wanted in terms of blending everything together. So I'm just gonna try going against the green so I can get a bit more closer shave then back down again, okay? As you guys can see here, it's, it's a bit better now. Now it looks a bit more even. And keep brushing, you can't brush too much, you know what I'm saying? Keep brushing, see how it looks, you know what I'm saying? Keep brushing, man, okay? Damn, I'm pretty good at this. As you guys can see, it looks pretty even now. So right, what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna do shadow lining up. I'm basically, Imagining how I'm gonna line up my hair, okay? If you guys box, you know about shadow boxing, you know, but um, anyways, let's get to it. All right, guys, so I'm using uh, this brush that we have here. You can be found in the bio and also this lineup machine here. Yeah, this is the best one, truthfully. The Anesty Outliner, from my personal experience, it'll give you the closest shave. And I actually adjusted mine, you know what I'm saying? So mine be hidden. Look at that, whoo! <laughs> one tap and it's hidden. My gosh. Yeah, also look at the bio, you know, we, already, we always uh, look out for you guys, make sure you guys can find whatever we're using in these videos. Um, so if you need to get your hands on one or if you don't have one, take a look at that. All right, guys, so the trick here is to go from lineup away, okay? From and away, from and away, all right? And um, you gotta take your time with it. Be patient, okay? Be patient and make sure you visualize. Don't rush it. Take your time, okay? Um, just try to make sure you can get it as, as even on both sides as you can. You know, use your fingers to trace, compare each side. Uh, sometimes our hair goes differently on each side of our hair, you know what I'm saying? So it's like... You might have to almost, not say create, but you have to try and just make it work and make it be as symmetric as you can. But make sure you also fo follow your natural hairline pattern, okay? People mess up a lot by not following their natural hairline and trying to change their hairline. Okay, then before you realize it, you've been pushing this way back. You know what I'm saying? Just follow your natural hairline and be cautious, take your time from your hairline away and you'll be fine. You'll be smooth, you know what I'm saying? And honestly, you guys, you guys don't have a beard, just skip this part, but for my bearded brothers, you know what I'm saying? You know we out here, gotta make sure the beard's crisp and clean. Gotta clean the bottom first, you know what I'm saying? Make sure everything looks nice and smooth. Yeah, looking sharp. As you guys can see, there are a bit of razor bumps there, but I've been using something that's been very good. Very, very good. It's called 10 Skin. I also put that in the link below. It's really helped me, because I was getting some bad bumps, but yeah, that's really changed up everything for me. Same thing, you know, with the, even with the beard, just from away, you know? You don't want to push it too back. Just from the beard, away. Yes, sir, we hit him. And yo, don't try to change, don't try to change things. That's the thing, like, you got to line it up. No one said create a beard. Like, this is not build a beard. You know what I'm saying, guys? Like, you don't be, don't be doing too much, all right? 
See, this is how I do my fades, you know? You don't have to do it how I do it, but you probably should, because this is this is the best style out there, you know what I'm saying, at the end of the day. You know, a little, little taper thing, you know what I mean? Just blending that. Now this is the magic stuff, okay? This right here is what I use. Um, it's like a, a dark brown, okay guys? And that's actually what makes our hair look natural. Don't use the actual black one because it's gonna be way too dark. And as you know, I just put some in the brush and I just go from, well, I guess, from the hairline towards the hair, you know? And just softly, softly, you know? I learned this from the best barber in town. Right? He really showed me how he gets it done. And a big tip that he told me is to make sure you line up your hair first and then do it. You do like a natural lineup, don't push it back, and then you add the enhancement to where the line is, okay? You're not creating a lineup, okay? That's the problem. Don't, don't go try to make a lineup. You know damn well your lineup doesn't start there. Don't go try to make a lineup before you're gonna look like this guy. Do that, just touch it up again. Do the enhancement, just touch it up. Before you realize it, it's gonna start looking good. I mean, looking crisp, looking perfect. You already know, guys, the little manly maintenance, you know, just cleaning up the corners of the, the beard, you know what I'm saying? Just... Cleaning up eyebrows just a little bit, you know what I'm saying? Gotta keep it looking clean, looking smooth. Okay, okay, as you guys can see, the fade is blending nicely to the dark part of the lineup, you know? Try to give it a, a pretty natural look, and we looking good, man. There's no gaps in the lineup, looks pretty smooth and crisp and nice, and this is a natural look that you won't get laughed at, you know what I'm saying? Don't be like those guys that be getting embarrassed in these shoes. Damn, my hair's a mess. What's going on with this boy? Well, you know we got that special secret oil, you know what I'm saying? Oh yeah, about to revitalize his hair right now. Okay, okay, you know, nice little do rag. Make sure everything is flattened. And now for the review. Who is that? Now nah, this guy's clean. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. Peace.